Hey guys, my name is Zakir and welcome to BTK YouTube channel. So it's just an update mail for you. Like we have released one of the company update in our Telegram channel. So once go to our Telegram channel and search for the company name Reach in Reach in Box. Okay. Here we go. So on June 15, I have uh, uploaded the Reach in Box role for backend developer engineer, but it is for front end developer. So both okay so for the batch of 2024 2025 and bangalore location and here is the link so those who have applied from our link have received the assessment mail and here you go with the pick so from iuc friend and developer technical assessment region box a your name so congratulations on clearing the initial round of screening as the next steps we would like to invite you to take up an exciting challenge technical assessment designed to help us to evaluate your skills in friend and development okay so you shall find the details description of the assignment in this document here is the document link i will be explaining what is the document is all about okay important instructions to note so timeliness you have you have uh, you shall have 40 48 hours to submit the assessment from the date of the email submission please adjust to the submission guidelines mentioned in the document okay so you may also visit our website and take a free trip to familiarize yourself with the project if not already done so please feel to reach out if you have any queries concerns and we are happy to assist i wish you all the best iron team okay reach in box.ai so simply they have given an assignment so i'll be explaining what is the assignment they have given 48 hours to submit the assignment very simple assignment but you know it takes time in case if you are a fresher but let's see what is the assignment is all about Okay, just stay update on our telegram channel. You will be finding a lot of jobs. I'll be getting a lot of updates also and one more update which I wanted to tell you is like so I recently started a playlist called um, Where is this Python DSA plus interview preparation course? Okay So where I will be taking you to in-depth Python concepts, okay, and mostly it will be on problem solving Okay, I will be explaining your concept and then I will be solving you around 30 plus 50 problems on that particular concept itself. So it will be helping you to understand what the inter, inner concept of that particular topic. And then in case if you find any uh, any problem related to that question, you will be in a, you will, you will be in a position to solve it. Okay, so that's how I will be framing this course. So as of now, I have released two videos in this. Just go through those videos in case if you find Okay. So in case if you find it both, just do subscribe our channel. Okay. And where is another one? okay i sorry I, I didn't tag it in the playlist i guess okay so they have two videos interpreter literal condition statements and looping statements and then i have explained a few problem statement also so i'll be uh, adding it in the playlist okay don't worry so let's go into this for the assessment so here you go with the region region inbox assessment for front-end role as an associate front-end engineer at regionbox.ai you will be you will have the opportunity to work with cutting gaze technologies and contribute to the development of our innovative out outbound marketing systems. We are seeking a talented individual with strong knowledge of React.js, Next.js, Stylewind, Axios, JavaScript, CSS, app routing, API integration to join a dynamic team. So they are simply asking you to be an entire full stack for this role. Okay. So key responsibilities, designing and implementing a responsive and initiative user interface for our onboarding marketing system, collaborating closely with backend developers, Sorry, backend developers to integrate front end components with server side logic, optimizing web applications for speed performance to enhance user satisfaction, ensuring cross browser compatibility and responsiveness across various devices, implementing and maintaining third party APIs to enhance functionality and feature seats, take full ownership of the assigned tasks, troubleshooting and problem resolution, research based practices, and implement them. Okay, all okay. Let us go to the candidate profile. You must have a portfolio of live and hosted projects that can be viewed and expressed by the hiring team. So you need to create your own portfolio either in your GitHub or you can use any of the yeah, AI resources over there. So in case if you paste that link in the uh, Google document that they have provided, then they can watch the watch your portfolio. Okay. You must have completed at least one internship, build web apps from scratch, understand the importance of pixel perfect UI. So you need to have one internship experience to eligible for this job. In case if you don't have also, maybe they might be considering, but when when you do this uh, assessment perfectly okay so startup friendly drive in the ice space environment and uh take love taking ownership to ensure a successful outcome okay so as it is a startup they are asking you to be more focused on more focused when delivering the product okay if you are a passionate about friend and development and eager to gain hands on experience in fast phase startup environment apply now and join as the revolutioning onbound outbound marketing in this a research inbox.ai okay 
So about the road core functionality front end development siphon range would be around 25,000 to 35,000 very good okay type of role is internship with PPO okay you'll be getting internship for six months and then if you do well you'll be getting into a full-time offer they will be offering you certain uh, salary maybe it is it will be around five to seven I guess not sure okay duration is six months for this internship location is remote or Bangalore you can choose any but mostly it will be remote okay start date immediately so must have skills react js next js style win axios javascript css approaching api integration existing profile with responsive design okay good to have understanding of state management either with redux toolkit or jotai or any other scalability typescript uh, state cn i don't know what are those but crazy so uh, as part of our selection process we would like to invite you to complete a short assessment that will allow you to access your capabilities and suitability for the role. This assessment will provide you the opportunity to demonstrate your proficiency in front end development as well as your availability to efficiently communicate and develop a project from scratch. Okay. So you have two days to solve this assessment. Okay. 48 hours have been provided for the by the company. Okay. So introduction to reach in box. So here is the reach in box summary. I, I don't want to go to that details. Okay. Mm, okay, let's see the, the assignment is used to use the designs and API provided and create a functional web app as for the following instructions implement the login page So you need to have a login page use the design provided. I will be exp I will be showing you the design also They have given the figma link here. Okay, once login to the user should be taken to the on box screen slash Google login So you need to login either Google to show a pop-up there. So implement fetching of data in one box using API integration Okay, you need to do a API integration there slash on box slash list you need to show the list of on boxes and then you have a get of one box of thread which means here we'll be passing id of the uh, on box okay you need to fetch those details also and then delete in case if you pass any id it should be deleted okay so implement keyboard shortcuts in one box d should be delete r should be reply box okay implement custom text editor need to add custom buttons in the editor like save and variables so implement reply click on send should send okay so we need to use a post method there post reply slash thread which thread you are tagging in okay from email to email subject body html we'll be seeing in the figma file so once i open this figma file so here you go hmm, there are a lot of people <laughs> doing this assessment line 23 okay so here you go with the login screen so this is how the login screen should be reach in box and then create an account sign up with google or create an account already have an account sign so this is a figma file okay so this is how you need to design the first page okay and then after the first page once the user login the next screen you should be in this manner okay so this home search mail say this i think telegram symbol something so the symbols has to be in the left side panel and then you need to have an empty space here showing in case if the user is on the first page and then once the user clicks on any other button so you need to show in this manner so all in boxes in case if the user have mails okay you need to show in this manner so 25 new replies new yes this should be a filter and then you need to show up the uh, what are the emails that you bought so once user click on this button okay and here here you go with the email template so from to and then subject view replies and all and activities okay email sent sent opened lead details okay and then in case if you want to write a reply mail so this is how you need to be showing it here so send the variables what are the variables that you want to define so preview email and the symbols okay and here you go same once you fill all those things so you should be in this manner like okay this person have sent this many responses okay and then let us go to here so once the email is done that will you need to ask your selection email will be deleted this is for the deletion okay so once the user want to try to delete this email you need to show a pop-up okay cancel or delete once delete it will be deleting okay so we need to implement in two manner we need to implement in dark and light manner so this is for the light okay so this is how the light should light mode should like should look like and this is the dark mode okay so hope you have understand the designs now let us go to this okay so design we have seen let us go to the api filter so api filter is when we you design the backend okay so uh, better token you'll be using your postman okay to with those endpoints and here you go with the list of all mails once you click on this mails this list once you click on this api endpoint you will be getting the list of emails to 
display on the screen okay so in the figma you have this emails right this one so you will be able to see all those things in your front end so curl is the location is you'll be you'll be passing it to your url and then what is the what we call what is the payload that we'll be giving let me edit so you'll be getting a json a json response in this manner so status success and in the data you will be having the list of emails okay so this is how it will be id from name uh, from email to email address ccc bcc thread id message id and in reply to reference subject body is read which is read or true or not and then folder inbox so in which folder you need to maintain that particular record and everything send that at what time does the email sent okay so this is are the timestamps okay so this is how the response should be response would be in case if you have called this endpoint okay so there is another endpoint one thread which will be fetching only one particular thread so in case if you want to see uh, see my mail which i have sent to the other person you can just use this email address so slash messages slash if my id is three if my id is three then i will be getting a json response in this manner so id is two and then id is three from email to email so thread is one so same okay but we'll be getting on one particular response okay you should be adding some relations okay to get the, all those things and then to delete an email so just see uh, v1 slash one box messages slash thread which is be a delete method okay so in uh, rest apis when we are so many we have around five i guess uh, get put delete post okay so these are the different methods that you can perform okay to retrieve or delete or update any data so just for good operations okay so this is a delete method so once you use this delete method so delete of message of two what you'll be doing like we need to show a response we'll be getting a response like status to 100 which means success and then emails uh, our messages email email messages deleted successfully all the message has to be deleted successfully and then we have a reset button so this endpoint you used to reset data in the on box back when you log in okay this has to be called once you log out or something okay just use according to your functionality this is how the json response will be and then we are posting the data okay so posting the data to certain thread so we need to pass a certain thread for example uh, thread is two so we'll be getting a request api request is like in this manner so data raw will be passing it here so to reply such a reply okay done so json reply same same so email thread not found in case if there is a no email address okay no email and then google sign in this is how you know google sign in should like you need to call this okay endpoint so that it will be showing you certain response okay google sign in successfully or not so these are the um, endpoints that i have given for your assessment and these are the screenshot uh, sorry these are the figma designs that you need to develop in two days okay so very easy but it takes time in case you might use the online ai resources to develop it with really is so easy guys don't worry so choose any of this framework that they have mentioned here like uh, react.js next.js Selvin, axios javascript css app routing api integration so all the front end technologies have been provided there on top so uh, maybe you can use backend services like php or uh, um, mostly react.js will be having php as a framework or you can use node.js or anything so just try to add some um, uh, backend systems and then you call those endpoints that will be enough okay so coming to the assessment submission so submit a uh, screen recording video explaining the app that you have created showcasing all the functionality mentioned in the instructions you may use tools such as room for this okay to creating a video so create a new github repositories to store your project details commit your code regularly with a clear and descriptive comment messages once you have completed the assignment push your code to the repository provide clear instruction how to run a view on web page locally including or installation steps required so in case if you are using uh, react which version of react that you are using you need to mention all those details in the readme file so that they can run on the local machines okay so additionally you may include in a readme file with additional information and explanations about your implementation of the choices okay in case if you have used any other technology just let us let them know that this is the technology that i've used and i have used and this is how you need to run the server okay so in case if you didn't complete the assessment in no worry so whatever your part you have done just you submit that okay they will be checking you in case if they find it worth they'll be scheduling an interview for it so this is the assessment from the region box and okay so in case if you any any in case if you have any research to us i'll be explaining you what what you need to be doing there okay so mostly that's it from me guys just do uh, uh this is just a requirement just to subscribe our channel just i've created you python playlist okay i'll be mostly uh explaining about all the 
uh, problem sets okay so do explore all the courses uh, not courses but the playlist okay and i will be getting lot of job opportunities and job updates daily don't worry and that's it from my guy that's it from me guys all the best bye bye